today our topic is unit 17 position and movement first thing transformation what is transformation transformation happen when you move a shape by reflecting translating and rotating it so the shape you start with is called object and the shape you finish with after transformation is called image like here you can see this subject here the mountain that is called object so when you reflect the shape okay as it is same they will draw here so it's called image now i will show you the small clip of a video so uh, i hope you understand let me show you one minute now here what is reflection now here the reflection is anything that reflect its shape like here is your object and they will reflect it okay they will create an image so it's called reflection now rotation it's called rotation okay when you move a thing and here's your center point okay here this is called translation when you move anything from one place to another that is called translation translation so here are the three things that i teach you today now come to the topic now here these are some examples okay so first let's start our topic draw uh, which draw show the correct reflection of a triangle so which things is show the correct reflection if you reflect this it will be opposite but it's now here in this case it looks same so it is not reflection because here it will make a right angle toward left side and it's also make a right angle toward left side so it's not possible as you can see in your real life when you raise uh, your left hand in front of mirror so the mirror show the right hand to you okay so as it is same this uh, the mirror must show the opposite thing now here it will show a right angle triangle but it is toward upper side but here it's toward downer side so this is the right one and here c is also the right one but d is not the right one when you reflect this so it is it will make this corner here not there so this is all so question number two you just reflect the same thing here so how you draw if anything should be here the same thing you draw here and here so i will show you anything should be here the same thing you draw here and if you have a diagonal mirror line here is a vertical mirror line here is a horizontal mirror line if anything is here opposite of this means you just totally turn this okay and draw the same thing the difference between the uh sorry object from mirror line should be same from object for offer your uh, so image of your now here the same thing should be here and we all do the same thing here now if you have a mirror line in the form of diagonal so what how you draw this so anything should be here so the difference between these two is must be same from mirror line to the real object is the one box and the uh, mirror line toward the image object should be also the same so please remember this thing that's very important now question number four he said if you have a mirror line that is x is equal to 3 so first thing you need to find where is x axis so we know that this line is x axis so where is 3 here is 3 so you will draw a mirror line here and after that you just draw the same shape as it is like now question number 5 question number 5 he said you find where you draw the mirror line so we know that the diff there are two box difference so there is a line that must be drawn between these two boxes so here is the line okay as it is same there is only one box difference so one divided by two is half so you must draw a line in between these this box okay and here is two box so two divided by one where where you draw the middle line here in this c part so that is also called diagonally because the difference between here to here is one box so it means it is divided into half part so we must draw into half parts now as it is same question number six you find the equation where i draw a mirror line from e to b if we have a shape here e to b so there are two box different so we must draw a line in the middle of this as it is same if you are talking about c so we will call this line is x is equal to 4 because see, this line is 4 so in the place of x axis but if we are talking about a and c 
So we will draw a line because there is the difference between two boxes. So we say 5x y is equal to 5 because this line is called y axis. So here which place where I draw 5. So we say 5 is equal to y is equal to 5. Thank you so much. As it is seen, you will draw the remaining all questions.